Okay, right on this video, I'm going to explain to you the exceptional ninja marketing secrets to make 500 to 1 million sales every month, non-stop. So, I would like to quickly talk about the mindset. Making money in your business, either it is offline business or online business, it requires having a solid and positive mindset. If you don't have a good mindset, you cannot attract the adequate wealth that you that you are looking up to. You must maintain a positive mindset. A positive mindset will motivate you to double up your efforts, to create value for people, it will help you to provide solution to post problems. Because if you don't believe in yourself, there is no how you can convince other people to believe in you. So definitely, you have to learn how to have a positive mindset, how to believe in yourself. If you only believe in impossibility and not possibility, it will be hard to triumph in any form of your endeavor. So there can be miracles only when you believe. If you believe that you can make a hundred thousand, definitely you will be ready to do all what it takes. You will be ready to pay the price. You will be ready to provide the value, to solve people's problem, to give value, to exchange for the money. But if you don't believe in the possibility, definitely you can't even get the motivation and the push to move forward and get and achieve your goal. So that is the importance of believing in yourself. It is very, very crucial to have a strong belief in whatever you wanted to do. And as you can see, I say on my presentation that nothing tremendous will ever happen in your struggle until the day you wake up to believe in the potential God has deposited in you. You want to succeed in life, you must always believe that no matter how fat or thin you have, what you need plus your ability can make you move as many mountains as possible. Everything starts with your faith. It starts with your mindset. It starts with your belief. You must make sure you have a strong belief. A strong belief plus ability to turn things around will definitely take you to your destination. It will definitely, it will definitely take you very far in life. It will help you to develop a powerful mindset. It will help you to develop and leverage on your potentials so that you can be able to acquire the necessary skills that will be useful to transform your life, to transform your business and to attract the required wealth that you are looking for. Now without wasting much of our time, let's move on to the next presentation. So he's still talking about if you allow your mind to dwell upon the inferior, you will definitely become inferior and surround yourself typically with inferior things. So there is nothing, there is no critical difference between the first class, the middle class and the low class. The only difference that separates the first class, the middle class and the low class is the mindset of the people we live in different categories of the classes. It is the mindset. If you think you can afford to buy a mansion, definitely you are going to do all what it takes to get the money to buy it. You want to belong to any society, to any class, you want to be flying first class, definitely you will provide the required solution or value that will attract the massive wealth to you. You'll be ready to pay the price. You'll be ready to move the mountain. you go with massive determination, with concentrated effort to go for your goal, to achieve your goal. If you allow your mind to dwell upon the inferior, definitely become an inferior and surround yourself with inferior things. But on the other hand, it is important and urgent to fix your attention. The best way to do so is to surround yourself with the best people so as to become the best. 
So if you want to become the best, you must surround yourself with the best people. You must learn from the best people. Choose the best mentor and learn from him or her so that you can emulate your hero and become a model to other people. Model the successful people, model what they are doing so, so that you can also become a hero to other people coming behind. You do know that there is a creative power within us that makes us into the image of God, which we give our attention to. Definitely, there is a subconscious mind, there is a subconscious power that translates or transforms whatever we are looking for in this life into reality. So that is why we need to make sure you have a positive mindset all the time. Think about positive things. Think about well and forget about poverty. Focus your attention on becoming poor. Definitely you become poor. There is nothing anyone can do about it because poor characters lead to poor income. Because anytime you want to go on to do something that will attract wealth to you, that your poor mindset will be disturbing you, it will be discouraging you and it will be telling you a lot of things that is not going to work. You just, just want to take it, just want to waste your time, you want to take risk, you want to do this, it will be discouraging you and you will end up not being able to go for gold. And if you focus your attention on becoming rich, no Jupiter can stop you from becoming rich because diligent character initially leads to success and greatness. So that is why you need to focus your attention on becoming people of people that we that we, people that we always people that we always have a positive mind. You must focus your attention on doing positive things. Thinking about positive aspect of life. So thinking about positive things, thinking about how you can achieve success and greatness. Thinking about how you can accomplish your aims and objectives. Always thinking about how you can help other people achieve their aims. Thinking about how you can provide solution to people's problem. Thinking about how you can create value. And become a model for other people. As you can see, just as I have said earlier on, that there is no much difference between being wealthy and being poor. The only difference there is the mind. That is why in life, whatever you don't want in your life, just try to avoid it. You shouldn't talk about it. You shouldn't attract it. If you want to attract success, do things that will help you attract success. If you don't want to attract poverty, stay away from poverty and anything that has to do with poverty. Forget about poverty. After all, you normally say poverty is not a person. God forbid back then. The truth of the matter is that consistent thinking about it will not eliminate you not eliminate it from your life. Instead, it makes it remain and prevents you from engaging in productive tasks that will produce wealth for you. Whatever you focus your attention on, whatever you focus your mind on, definitely it will expand. So if you want to create more value, if you want to become a successful person in life, you want to become relevant, you want to become a multi-millionaire, you want to be famous, you want to achieve greatness in life, you just have to do away with anything that has to do with poverty. Don't even talk about it. Because you are not interested in it. And avoid any attitude of poor people. In fact, if it is possible, eliminate poor people in your in your circle. Don't 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 don't, don't associate yourself with poor people. Because you will never get any positive idea from poor people because they have resorted to to being poor and they are they find themselves in abject poverty 
So if you don't want your life to be the same with these people, the best thing is to avoid them, is to never have anything to do with them. So the truth of the matter is that consistent thinking about it will not eliminate it from your life. Instead, it leads to be made and prevent you from engaging in productive tasks that produce weight for you. If you want to become rich, you must never study poverty. Discipline yourself to focus your attention strictly on what you want, not what you don't want. People of low class, the poor people, always focus on what they don't want. They always attract bad things to their life. They have resorted to being poor because they subjected their life to poverty. And they never think they need to escape the poverty and go to the other side, which is middle or first class. They believe they are destined to be poor. And I strongly believe that no one is destined to be poor except what you choose to, to be. If you want to become poor, definitely it's your choice. If you want to become rich and wealthy, definitely it's your good choice and decision. So I've never seen anything that brought into being by thinking about their opposite. You can't say it is not possible for you to keep on attracting things that will make you become poor and expect to be rich. It is not possible. So that is why you need to separate yourself from mediocrity people and associate yourself with rich and wealthy people, emulate their behaviors and attitude, work towards achieving the greatness, and definitely you will become a successful person in life. If you have never subscribed to this video before, try to do so. Look for the subscribe button, the bell button, click on it. Click on the subscribe button. After the, you click on the subscribe button, look for the bell notification, the bell button, so that whenever we produce a new video, you can be receiving the notification. Thank you so much for, for watching this video. See you some other time.